I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. A Kentucky woman who allegedly tried to strangle another woman with a bra was thwarted recently when the victim fought back with a ceramic chicken. And nothing I can add to that story will make it any funnier. An Ohio woman stabbed her boyfriend because he was eating all the salsa. I'll bet he wishes he had a ceramic chicken. An Arkansas truck driver has pleaded guilty to trading $50,000 worth of lunch meat for crack cocaine. It's unclear exactly how much crack was traded for the truck of lunch meat. There you go. Undeniable proof that drugs do impair your judgment. A miniature dachshund has been rescued after spending 13 days trapped underneath a concrete slab at her home in Kansas. The dog, named Lucy, apparently dug underneath the slab that was supporting the house's air conditioning unit. Underneath a concrete slab in Kansas during the height of tornado season. Isn't that exactly where you want to be? A new study shows that a third of Americans who are saving for retirement currently have less than $1,000 put away, which still puts them way ahead of the government trying to fund Social Security. A South African kayaker recently came face to face with a great white shark when the predator grabbed his boat, gouged it, and then spent an hour harassing him. Apparently, sharks don't know how politically incorrect bullying is nowadays. In the UK, a group of Star Wars fans tried to make a good impression in order to score some tickets to the upcoming movie premiere by sending a weather balloon into space with a model of the Rebel Alliance's X-Wing fighter attached. Not bad, not bad, but my plan to get free tickets is to eat bacon-wrapped pizza until I bear an uncanny resemblance to Jabba the Hutt. An armed robber in his 60s broke his leg while holding up a convenience store in Japan. He then used the store's phone to call an ambulance. Police are planning to arrest the suspect when he's released from the hospital. As for any excuse he might come up with for his actions, he doesn't have a leg to stand on. That's your Daily Dose of Weird News. I'm Darren Marlar. Get more weird news at dailydoseofweirdnews.com. Until next time, keep it real. Weird. 